Hi, I'm Steve Brewer. I'm the head of bike assembly here at BBR. I'm going to show you how to lace and show your XR50 wheel. Start off lacing a rim. You got two different spokes. Notice one's a 90 and one's a little less than 90 degrees. You'll have 14 of each. This will be your outside spoke and this will be your inside spoke. And you'll have 28 nipples. Okay, to start off lacing your wheel, take your 90 degree spoke, pick any spot on the hub, stick it through, and go two over, stick it through again, and then repeat all the way around this side of the wheel. Once you have all the spokes in this side, flip the hub over, and pick any spot again, and start over on this side. Once you've placed all your 90 degree spokes in, take the little bit less than 90 and start filling in the remaining holes. Once you've placed all the spokes into the hub, take your rim and just set it over the hub. Notice when you put, place the rim over the hub, you got inside and then outside inside and then outside. These two will go to the top of the hub and these two will go to the bottom of the hub. Take your top spoke and your bottom spoke, cross them over and then place them in the rim. Once you cross top two, take the bottom two and repeat. And then just continue to work your way all the way around the rim going top to bottom, top to bottom, top to bottom until you're complete. Once you've laced your wheel all the way up with the remaining threads, you want to start tightening down on the nipple until there are no threads left on the spoke. And then you just want to continue all the way around the rim and then we'll be ready for truing. Once you've tightened all the nipples down evenly, there'll be a few threads left in the top of the nipple. You want to tighten those all the way down, the flat blade screwdriver, until the spoke is barely sticking out of the top of the nipple. Once you've tightened the nipple down the last bit, find the tube stem hole and use that as a reference point. And then start tightening each nipple one turn from left to right or right to left all the way around the rim until the rim is tight. Once you've gone around and tightened the rim all the way up, on the weld on the rim there's always going to be a hop or a wobble. You're never going to get that out but you can true it better. Unless you have a truing stand you can use your spoke wrench as a reference. Spin the rim wherever it touches. It's touching there so the rim's pulling to the right you want to tighten on the left. One turn only. Continue to true around the wheel until you have barely any side to side motion and then double check to make sure everything's tight and then you're set to go. Put your tire on and ready to ride.